Welcome back to Big Boy. Uh, man, I don't even know if I can explain what has happened, what's transpired in this battle. It is all over the place. I made a couple of mistakes, so let's get that out of the way. I moved the uh, vehicles too quickly, so I just made them sit for a turn. Uh, probably made it a little easier for the Somalis, for the skinnies, to uh, have it take advantage of firing at those vehicles if they had an opportunity to, but they really didn't. And uh, the other ma major mistake I made was I forgot to uh, roll for the blocks, the roadblocks that are on the map. And so I just I just did those rolls because every time, every, wherever there's a roadblock, you roll each turn and see what generates there. And so this is why it's kind of like this never ending chaos of additional units being spawned in various places on the map there's one here another one there's another one somewhere one over here on the right uh, which i just put down actually and uh then there's the wreck over here on the right hand side and you get reinforcements coming from the top and from the side anywhere along the side based on cards that are drawn just like a, a deck of 52 cards that is a standard uh card playing deck and that, and then you buy buy pieces. So uh, we we kind of we kind of went uh, a little cray cray uh, because we had the convoy coming up the road here, taking a hard right. Where are they? Where is the convoy now? I've lost it. That's right, because they started moving. Where is my convoy? Oh yes. Okay. Here we go. I've got one of the Humvees here and there was a, a helo crash one of the helos crashed and then <clears throat> i brought another humvee up to here up on the right hand side near where this guy is up here where the uh, crash site is uh, we've got to reduce that crash site and, and destroy the uh destroy the doohickey destroy the the crash site and I'm just looking, and here's the other Humvee down here, uh, and a truck with troops, and another truck with troops just to the left out of screen. No wonder I couldn't see them there behind my field of vision. So we had started coming in this way, and once we got into visual contact with the, the crash site, you can stop having to be in convoy mode. So I immediately, immediately, as soon as I was eligible to do that, just started bringing forces down and using them to support the troops that are spread all over the place, trying to get to the crash site and trying to uh, get the VIPs off the map and all sorts of crazy stuff. But you'll have to go see the first video to understand what I'm talking about VIPs. But there were several things going on at once here in this campaign and You've got to kind of reconcile all of them. And in the meanwhile, you've got all these spawning bad guys all over the place. Hence all the fire markers. Hence the trucks trying to help. Hence the helos trying to help. Uh, we had a helo get hit and crash uh, and died. Fortunately, it crashed on a mob and a, an enemy unit and killed everybody in the hex. We had to attack it with uh, six strength points. It was nasty. And uh, I've got my wounded sergeant here in this squad. Everyone's now trying to start moving off the map uh, once we as soon as we destroy this with the navy seals here as soon as we destroy this site here we can start pulling everybody back and getting off the map uh, pretty tense it's been uh, backwards and forwards you know you, I forgot just how bad the Somalis are I mean they unless they hit with a machine gun or RPG you know, they get chewed up really hard because their morale is four and it's hard for them to stay in the game because they don't shake, they just die. <laughs> and they're, they're miserable, but you get lots of them. So uh, we, and we've also been uh, bringing on some technicals onto the map. So we've got, uh, well, this one blew up. We got shot by the helo, but the rec recoilless rifle and whatnot uh, and, and and big 50 cals on the on the back of the Toyota pickup trucks are causing a little bit of havoc, but I'll I'll say at the moment that with no troops lost other than one helo, we're in pretty good shape. 
I've just got to manage to get all my guys off together off the map now and see if they can survive the, uh, the, the rush that may occur from any of these roadblocks. And I keep, as soon as I see a guy spawn on these roadblocks, I really try and, you know, get a vehicle or a squad or a chopper over there and start peppering them with fire and trying to, you know, uh, thin out the herd, so to speak, of bad guys. Uh, so there's been a heavy uh, rotation of guys dying and coming back onto the map. Uh, we're, we're well into, this is near the end of turn five. So uh, this has probably got another three, four turns to go before it's pretty obvious that it'll be over. And uh, I just want to give you a little update and show you what's going on. If anyone wants to see some specific examples of play, I'm probably not the guy to do that for you. You should go check out Nate's uh, channel, Gimpy Gamer, and look at his examples of play. They All the rules apply to all the modules equally, including this one with its funky squares. All right, I'm going to let you guys go. Talk to you soon.